We meet again, darling. Took me a while to find you. Those monsters were no easy task. Judging from your expression, you thought I was dead. Is that right? Oh, these scars? Don't worry. I can heal them later. But I didn't come here to talk about my well-being. It's about Ray. He was attacked by hunters. I don't know his current state of well-being. I overheard some humans talking about it and... I know where we can find him. I know you would be worried about him, and I've tried to get more information, but I can't get risk getting killed. Only you can go and save him. I'm only telling you this because I've been watching you for quite a while now, and you always seem so sad, constantly replaying your daily routine. As much as I hate to say this, I can tell that you miss Ray. <laughs> that lucky dog. I suggest you hurry up and change. It's cold outside. I'll take you where they took Ray. I'll be waiting outside. Let's go. Oh, this horse? It's not mine. Don't worry. I'll return it later. Come on. Get on. Whoa. <laughs> We're here. So, there are two options in getting him out. You either sneak in and help him escape, or talk to the head hunter and convince them to let Ray go. But I'm quite sure that won't work. So, you should go with option one. To help with your escape. I can lure away the hunters. All I can tell you is, it won't be pretty. So you have to act fast. Think you can do this, darling? Alright. That's the spirit. Let's begin. There's commotion outside. I think it's an attack. Wait, what about this werewolf? <laughs> Don't worry. He can't do anything. It's wounded and chained. Let's go. Did you know? <coughs> they hurt me really bad. They didn't even bother removing the arrow. They're lucky I can't. <coughs> They're lucky I can't attack them like this.
Wait. We can't go to the entrance door. It reeks of human blood. Who is... Norman? He's alive? <laughs> Figured much. He didn't do anything to you, right? <sighs> That's a relief. We're close to the exit. Now, where do you think you're going, Ray? <sighs> ah, I see you have a friend. How sweet. Young lady, I'm afraid you can't take him away. Helping him escape would be considered treason. Ray, it looks like you've forgotten our deal. Deal? Have you forgotten? Well, I guess it can't be helped. You were so little back then. I'll remind you. You were supposed to bring me your Pax leader, and you didn't. He's dead. Hmm. And why is that? Because I killed him. I suppose it was your only choice. After all, he was the only one who knew you weren't. A natural born wolf. Tch. The pack leader knew that you were my son, the son of a hunter. Which brings me to the question why did he leave me in the first place? <laughs> I didn't leave you. You left me behind in that forest on purpose. The wolf leader accepted me, knowing who I was. But you pushed me to the point where I had to betray him! You killed so many of my pack, only to torment me! I had to leave them so you would stop hunting them. Yet again, I was alone. And why didn't you come back to me? You're a horrible being. I would never return to someone who has hurt me and the people that I cared for. I would rather die than never come back to you. It hurts me that you speak to me in such manner. I had to take you by force, in order to protect you from the other hunters. What I do is out of love. Hmm. You say that my actions are not out of love? And what gives you the authority to talk to me that way? I suggest you stay silent, unless you'd like to match arrows with the ray. Don't you dare hurt her! Hmm. I see the years you've been alone have made you rebellious. If you don't want her to get hurt, I suggest you stay here with me. <laughs> huh? Who just... Go! Hurry!